Hello everyone. My name is Jay and I am going to explain about cross tabs in Tableau. Cross tabs in Tableau is a type of chart that is also known as text table or pivot table. Why text table? As you can see I have created a cross tab over here that only contains data. There is no any graphical representation of any kind of data over here. The cross tabs or we can say text table because of its high resemblance with pivot table of excel sheet it is also called as pivot tables of tableau cross tabs being one of the most basic and popular used forms of charts in tableau so let's get started with the basic thing and at the very first we have to connect the tableau with the kind of file you have I have excel file so I am connecting with Microsoft Excel and I am selecting my file and just see we have three sheets over here because in my original excel file I have created three spreadsheets over here as you can see and that's why it's showing three sheets over here what we have to do we have to select one of the sheet and drag it over here so whatever the content was there in that excel file it will be displayed over here so starting with our first worksheet as you can see at the top rightmost corner we have show me tab and by dragging over the first option you can see there's something written that for text table we can try one or more dimensions and one or more measures so we will go with that what we will do is we will select the product category and drag it over into the rows we will select product subcategory also drag it into the rows and product date into the columns and selecting the sales from measures and drag it into the mark what this will create is will this will create a cross tab a basic cross tab which will have a product category product subcategory and the sales done in that year that is in 2015 as we will drag over any of the option it will shows as in this as we can see it is showing the sales as 40 10480 in the year 2015 with the category office supplies and the subcategory envelopes so what we can do is we can drag this sum and here as you can see the, the ABC has now converted into the number values this is the basic cross tab we can ever have what we can do we can change the color of the text here by just clicking here and whatever the text you whatever the color you choose so I am choosing navy blue and see the color has changed to navy blue we can also do one thing as you can see when we drag order date over into the columns by default it got selected as year what we can do we can change it we can change it into several options like quarter what this will do this will divide the whole year into two parts that is the first six months and the another six months and it will display the sales or we can change it into month so and it will shows some months with the sales in that month category and subcategory cross tabs also supports calculated fields for dynamic value representation so what we can do is we can click over here and add table calculation and just selecting the percentage of total what this will do this will create the percentage that will correspond to the sales in that month with that category and subcategory with respect to the, the total sale as we will select this table across it will select the rows it will select that particular row and will give the output with respect to that when we will select down it will select particular column 
and it will show the data. But when we select table, it will select whole table and will show and will show the total sale, the percentage in that month and in that category and subcategory. As you can see over here. By which, if you want to see that, if you if you are getting headache by seeing this small numbers and if you want to change it, what we can do is we can select over here and change it into color. So as you can see here, it is showing that it is showing the index. The more darker the color is, the more num the more sale was done in that month with that category and subcategory. The lesser the less dark the color is, the less sales were done in that month with that category and subcategory. We can also change it into the size, greater the size, greater the sales in that month category and subcategory. So we will keep it as simple. See, this is the this is a basic cross tab. But my question is, why don't we use cross tabs popularly in the tableau? Because this has some reason. It has there are many limitations, but the in the very basic thing, it has two limitations. First, it has fixed rows and fixed columns. By default, we have only six rows and columns in Tableau, but we can increase it. We can increase it by clicking on the analysis part, analysis tab, table layout, and advance. As you can see, it can have 50 a maximum number of rows and it can have 50 maximum levels of columns as you can see i am clicking on the below arrow and it's getting less but when i am clicking it and when i am clicking it after 50 it's not getting increased that means we have in total maximums of 50 rows and columns the another limitation was difficulty in interpretation. The cross tab is the representation of data in the textual form, which is comparatively little difficult to interpret the other graphical forms of representation. You need to focus on the reading and comparing the numbers of the deriving any pattern or insights. This generally creates headache for us and that's why we mainly don't use cross steps. Thank you.